is the women's 13 14 500 yard freestyle final seat. In lane number one at the bottom of your screen from Pleasanton Seahawks, Maggie Caulfield. In lane two, Jennifer Campbell, Palo Alto. Lane three, Sarah Shimura, Santa Clara. Lane four, Rachel Knowles, Pleasanton Seahawks, your leader from this morning. Lane five, Jesse Vazdas, Nova, Virginia. Lane six, Paige Matherson. Lane seven, Alex Grimes. And in lane number eight, Hannah Eastman. And another swimmer right on that five minute mark from this morning is Rachel Knowles, who is your prelim leader, 50046. So she is also knocking right on that door. Almost a straight line across the pool here at the 75 yard mark. We'll see as this 500 plays out how these ladies change it up, but with a slight lead at the 100 in lane number three is Sarah Shimura. She's gonna get her feet around to the wall first at a 56-41. Shimura was a 504-7 this morning, so she is on pace to be under that mark and definitely giving Rachel Knowles a run for her money and seeing if we can get a few of these ladies under the 5-0 barrier. Approaching the 200 yard mark, still out front in lane three is Sarah Shimura. 156.45, great 200 here in this 500. Very, very close race. Trying to stay on her feet in lane four is your prelim leader, Rachel Knowles. But still in the race two, right above her in five is Jesse Vazdas and Paige Matherson. At the halfway mark, Sarah Shimura is still out front, 227.58, on pace to be under five minutes. Trying to keep it close is Rachel Knowles from Pleasanton Seahawks in four. Sarah Shimura, 504.7 again this morning. She might have had a little bit left in her tank from the prelim swim. She has extended her, her lead to about a body length here at the 300 mark. 256.66, so if she can maintain right around double O, she is going to be under five minutes here for the 13-14 ladies. <laughs> also another interesting point to talk about in swimming is strategy and what side of the lane you're going to swim on, especially for those 500s. We see people trail certain side of the lane. Some prefer to stay in the middle. We see that in lane four, Rachel Knowles is really riding up on that lane line right next to the leader, Sarah Shimura, maybe trying to catch a little bit of her draft. I think she's got to catch up a little bit if she's going to catch any of the wake from Shimura, though. Shimura really putting herself out there on the front half has done a terrific job so far. Holding on here on the back half and with just over 100 yards to go. It's definitely Sarah Shimura in control. If Knowles wants to catch a wave, she's going to have to pick up the pace a little yeah. bit and catch up to Shimura. I think Knowles has a slight chance. She's still at her feet. Sarah Shimura, her breaths are starting to look pretty long here. So she is going to have to fight here to keep Rachel Knowles off her heels. 75 yards left to go. And Knowles is starting to turn it on. She is now at the hips of Shimura. And that's the bell, 50 yards left to go. 427.94 for Shimura. They are both on pace to be under five minutes. Great race for third place going on there at the top of your screen and five, Jesse Vazdas and Paige Matherson right above her. 25 yards left to go. Shimura trying to hold off the prelim leader, Rachel Knowles in four. It looks like she's gonna do it. 
Your champion this year in the girls 13, 14, 5 under free is Sarah Shimura with a 4.56.7.0. Touching for second, Rachel Knowles, 4.57.8.5. And touching third in six is Paige Matherson, 5.00.18. Great swim there for those ladies. Two getting under five minutes, another two right at 5.00. So those great, that was a great.